The constitutional future of this country has been decided largely behind closed doors by a small minority of people, and I mean the judiciary, I mean some academics, I mean the Waitangi Tribunal and the public service, and they have invented a principle of the treaty that it's about a partnership between races, where in order to find out your role in the governance of three waters or the new planning panels under the Natural and Built Environments Act or within the new healthcare system, you have to first know who your ancestors were, and there has never been a society that has succeeded when people are divided by their superficial characteristics. What we need instead is a clear statement by Parliament that the principles of the treaty are what it actually says, that we have na tikanga katoa ritetahi, or the same rights and duties. That's what it actually it says. And if we make sure states. that that is the underlying principle of our country, what is article then two, you David? don't need this division. Self-determination, self no, no, it's to Tino be understood. The word is understood. And that means that you and should be able to run your own rights. schools. You when should be able to run your own health care. full and exclusive so we rights actually to want your this kind, referendum okay. to your family. So so okay, the, Rawiri, no, hang we, on a moment, we, we, want, we want this referendum to put the treaty okay. properly understood as uh, a uniting document uh, at the centre of our constitutional arrangement. Ra 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 then we're going to be able to move forward and solve the very real challenges we need to overcome, such as health and housing and education. We understand. We'll get to that in a moment. Rawiri Waititi, your right of reply. Oh, look. This is just this is just a uh, fairy tale that he's talking about.